What's up, Freaks? Tex here, and I'm bringing you some gameplay of The Order 1886. Now, I'll be honest with you, when I first heard about this game, I'm not really sure what it's supposed to be. Is it supposed to be just like an action game? Is it like an action horror game? Is it a survival horror game? I'm not really sure. I didn't look too much into it. But all I know is I saw this gameplay, I'm like, hey, that looks like a survival horror game, so let's f fucking talk about it. Now, The Order 1886 is a PS4 exclusive coming out sometime in the future and this gameplay demo was showed at the um, Sony press conference at E3 so I looked into what this game is supposed to be about so apparently you're in a steampunk um, version of Old England and you are part of a group that hunt and kill werewolves and it does sound pretty intriguing but I also did read a bunch of comments and people saying that ho hopefully it doesn't turn out like watchdogs you know, whole lot of hype, not a lot of sizzle. That's not how that saying goes, is it? Be honest with you, I do not have a PS4 or even an Xbox One. But after watching this gameplay, it does look pretty interesting. I mean, it's not mind blowing by any regards. In fact, I kind of sped this footage up because they don't show a lot of the game. A majority of this demo is just cutscenes, which is fine because it looks like a pretty atmospheric game. But then again, it could be an action horror game, kind of like Resident Evil 4 is, and Revelations is. Where it has a lot of action sections and a lot of scary sections, and they kind of mix them and put you in certain situations where it's an action game, then it's a horror game. So that might be what this is going to do. Well, I'm happy that these next-gen consoles are finally getting some games out there, some exclusives, you know. Granted, this game does look mildly interesting, and it does seem pretty cool. But I won't know until I play it. And will I play it? Not likely. But if I do, I'll let you know. Yes, I fast forward the shit out of this video. I mean, it was originally only about five minutes long, so it didn't really show much anyway. Some pretty cool atmosphere stuff, him finding his werewolf, and like I said, a lot of it's just cutscenes. But we're just gonna watch the rest of this video play out and we're gonna see this guy try to take on this werewolf. I'm not going to talk. Except for now. That would be a good game if you were Sherlock Holmes and you were facing werewolves. That would be a good game. Oh shit. I fought the werewolf and the werewolf won. So intriguing. Yes? No? Maybe so? Alright freaks. Thanks for watching. I'm Tex. I'll catch you next time.